Just okay. So, team number two is here. This is um, our first kind of kind of checkpoint, I guess, on our on our snowboarding trip. We have made it to the visitor center, but you're not allowed to visit here. Um, there's no bathrooms. There is no entrance. There's nothing but this yellow car and a couple trucks behind us and lots of wood. We're waiting to see if JV and the rest of team one will make contact with us um, and kind of tell us what to do. Because to be honest, all he gave us was an address. Um, despite all the information that he has loaded into our group chat, we don't exactly know where to go now that we are here. We so. are currently riding up the mountain looking for our next location. We're not exactly sure where we're supposed to be. Do you guys know where we're supposed to be? Uh, resort? Okay. <laughs> okay. I've never been here before, but... Lucas is using his Boy Scout instincts. We're on the right track. Onwards and upwards. This looks like the same creek. Yep. That is weird. And this tree looks familiar. No, no, and that no. braid of snow. No. Alright, so we think we're making some good progress here. We got some good signs. Snowboarders and such. Civilization. There's a bus. Bro, I haven't seen one of those in like 100 miles. Got these awesome kind of like sideline, like slope side lodges that look pretty familiar. Okay, I just finished my chicken sandwich. Yeah, yeah. We just are eating the last of our rations. We barely made it, but look what we found. Am I dead? It is a little tilster. A little bit. First things first, beanie, right? All right, next things next. Uh, I guess I should switch to one of these, these little neck scarf baklava type thingies. Balaclava? Balaclava, baklava. Is it baklava? Baklava? Baklava is the dessert. Okay, so I don't know if I can do mask and baklava, but... Balaclava. <laughs> that's what it's saying, guys. It's baklava. Ba baklava. Uh, Mike, I got you. There you go. Thank you, sir. Merry Christmas, brother. <laughs> Dude, I think today I'm just gonna rock base layer, um, extra layer of socks uh, to keep my feeties nice and warm, and what you see on me. So the only difficult part is. <sighs> changing in my car. Which isn't too bad, to be honest. Uh, if you're wondering why I sound like Darth Vader, it's because we are completely suited up. I've got on all my stuff. I've got a neck warmer thing, my baklava. I've got on a mask underneath this to keep extra warm. Um, I've got my goggles, I've got my gloves, I've got my pants and everything. Uh, obviously you saw the base layer and everything underneath. Beanie, uh, everything is good to go. Um, we are missing a couple members of Team Sexy this year. We are missing Esser, um, we're missing Jen, we're missing Jaxter. Um, but that's okay, Team Sexy Desu, or Team Sexy Desu forges on. Um, regardless of the number it's about quality not quantity right so yeah uh quick recap obviously we had a four hour drive up to our resort um we have checked into our stuff technically and got our tickets and everything but our room is not ready yet so um we are going to obviously soak up as much as we can of our all-day lift tickets head on over to the slopes um i guess sorry the rental place first huh yeah yeah, this is a lot of money. This outfit, super expensive. <laughs> hey, don't, don't expose me! Don't expose me like that. Hey, what's a Chinese Starbucks? Ah. <sighs>
This is super cool. This is like right out of all of my childhood like snowboarding here, games, right? fantasies, and I'm sure like, Katie, can, Katie can attest. Anybody who's played SSX Tricky or Snowboard, snowboard Kids, kids anything too, like that. Especially because you can walk around the town. Definitely. I'm like, this Whoa. resort and everything oh, reminds sweet. me of exactly that. I'm like, so definitely a cool little experience. I mean, obviously people are staying here and they're, they're camped up in their little apartments and uh, hotel rooms and everything like that, but you also got all these little shops and restaurants that are like right down here um, available for you to kind of indulge in while you're on and off the slopes. Cool. Go. Okay. So all three of you. All right. No. Um, do you have a bathroom by any chance? Do you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, I do. Yeah? Uh-huh. Cool. Is this first time on the uh, no, second time. Second time? Yeah. Sweet. Saying it a little bit. Uh, what size shoe do you wear? Uh, I'm like 11 and a half. I don't feel it. <laughs> what's your name, bro? Aiden. Aiden. And Aiden, uh, what's your friend over here? Jacob. Jacob. Dude, Aiden over here, I'm like, it's truly one of a kind. Literally sat down as soon as he saw my GoPro. Asked about the channel and immediately decided to support and subscribe. So shout out to Aiden over here, man. He's hooking us up with all the gear we need. And over there and just follow that out. There's like free parking and stuff like that that you can go to. You can night ski there until nine o'clock. Oh. Cool. Silver Creek is probably. So this close at four, right? Yeah, it closes 4:30 up here. Let's stop running and then you can go down to Silver Creek and ski until nine. Cool. They have a really sweet tire over there. I don't know how confident you are on a snowboard. <laughs> uh, not very confident. <laughs> <laughs> Still we building that confidence. Tire. Okay. There we go. All right, on the bunny slopes, got our bindings on, snowboard. There's Cam. Come on, Mike. Big back, big back. All right, lead the way, brother. Lead the way. Here we go, Mike. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? What's up, baby? So JB had a little bit of a pro tip. I'm sure you guys who are avid snow motors already know this. However, for the newbies like myself, um, a quick little pro tip. If you've got these boots that are like the twisty kinds right here, as you can see it's got a little knob and a twist like that. Um, it's always kind of a good thing to just temporarily, every once in a while while you're on the slopes, reach down and re-twist them. Here we go. Where's our third? Where's Mike? Big Mac, where's he at? Where's Big Mac? Big Mac, baby! What? Not you. <laughs> Let's go, Mike! <laughs> okay, guys, so that concludes our first portion oh, of snowboarding. Not too bad. Um, I imagine that I was gonna be a lot rustier than what I actually was i was actually pretty smooth today so i was pretty pleased with my progress uh, i'm gonna be heading off to the green slope probably a little bit later tonight get something a little bit more challenging so i can practice my carving um and then on top of that i'm gonna see if i can find a, a helmet a rental helmet or something um with a mount on it because that would be absolutely fantastic really wish i would have been able to get the um gopro max lens mod to really get that like super wide super view kind of uh look to my vlog but Hey, I'm gonna work with what I got and get the footage that I can. So now we're off to get some lunch, get a little bit of fuel in our systems, um, and we will check in with you guys and show you what we got going on then. Cheat Mountain Pizza, if y'all can see that right there. 
running in to get a couple slices. You know I'm always down for pizza. This is never a bad day for pizza, to be honest. Let's be real. Everything. Just to let you guys know, we are only doing right. Okay, so we got our pizzas. Everybody is stocked up on food, and now our room is available. We are officially able to check in. So it's time to go back, get some biru, get some pizza in us, and uh, refuel for night snowboarding. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Not bad. We've got our own little kitchen over okay, here. Stove, toaster, microwave, fridge, yeah, freezer, yeah. sink, yeah. dishwasher. Yeah. Like we got the whole nine yards over nice. here. Got a nice little bedroom in here. This is nice and quaint and cozy. Dude, is this this looks like literally a closet specifically for skis. It's so freaking tiny and freaking snowboards. That's pretty neat. And then, the bathroom right there, and let's check out this living room area. This is nice, nice little common room slash sitting area. Got a TV and a fireplace and a mic built into the house. What is this? Room key. Sweet. Got a room key. In my pocket, I think. No, in your wallet. Huh? Oh, I'm doing a tour right now. And then. Look, customary stalactites. Does this like heat up out here? Do we have like a little heater? I don't know, I guess we'll find out, but wow, and we are right on the slopes. It doesn't get much better than that, y'all. Yes. We are going to head out for our first evening of night skiing. Unfortunately, we will not be able to bring the entire crew. Luki has suffered some minor shin contusions from his $2,000 boots. So, <laughs> well, it's okay. as of tomorrow, he will be joining us when he gets some replacements from the rental shop. But for today, he will be just taking it easy and recovering inside of... And I'm going to steal the Declaration of Independence. Inside of the apartment. <laughs> Anyways, um, we um, have about... What time is it? Come on, microwave, show me the time. Oh, okay. It's 6.49, uh, the slope's close at 9, so we have about two hours to gather ourselves, um, get out there to how, wherever it is. How far is it? It's like 10 minutes. Okay, so it's not that far. Um, and kind of get back at it. Uh, I'm not sure what slopes are at this location. It's a slightly different one from where we were uh, earlier today. So I guess we'll find out and see when we get there. Uh, hopefully we've got something that's similar to like a green slope or something so I can practice some more carving and turning. Is that the, the, the end with the black diamonds on it? The other side? No, that's, that's less intense. This is cool. Silver Creek. Side. We can't even see the freaking mountain. There's nothing that you can see up there. Images. So how this is gonna work, me and JV are gonna do our best to check out this uh, green slope, get down to the bottom of it, um, and see how the lift is, see how difficult things are and stuff like that. See if it is cool for the rest of our crew to join, and if it is, then everyone will be joining. If not, then we will meet them back here at the top of the bunny slopes. James, you ready? Let's do it. Oh shit. Heels, heels, heels. Heels, Mike, heels. I'm gonna try and keep this behind you guys. Let's 
be here. So we're gonna take this sideways. And then we're gonna bank into our turn. Here we go. <laughs> Dang it, I was trying to cut, man. There we go. Break right here. Good. I'm gonna take those hills nice and slow. There we go. Back in. Ride it out. Where to? Down there? Good lord. Man, almost took me out. First lift experience. First lift, here we go. Yeah. Yep. First lift experience today. I was bunny sloping it. I was doing pretty good down the green. Fell a couple times, but has to be expected. It's only my second time. But here we go. All right. Do you want to be on? Let me see. Look at it. Hey, I'll be on this side, Jay. Oh, that hurt <laughs> a lot. <sighs> that kind of squeezed my uh, my calf down there. You're right. Not prepared for that. No. No, I gotta be careful here. Yeah. There's no um, that no really, safety. Like, pinched my calf. <laughs> I, well, there's no uh. No good at wrist handle for my GoPro, so I'm just gonna have an iron grip here. But check out the lift and our views right now. This is pretty nice. For, yeah, this isn't not, bad. It's not too foggy. It really isn't. I mean, I, I've been rocking no goggles and I've been okay. Yeah. Okay. It's only when the snow machines hit. Yeah, yeah, the snow machines, snow machines do make it a little bit difficult for when you're trying to see, obviously, because it's literally just spraying snow yeah. <laughs> aggressively into your face. So you're gonna need some type of, you know, hand up or goggle or something. Yeah, this is cool. Check exactly. this out. So people can go down rails and stuff. Yeah, that's super like cool. Little jump here and go there. Go snowboard guys. One day, maybe. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Doesn't look too steep. Let's see, let's see. Depending on where that kid goes. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Left, guys. Yep. Okay, here we go. Oh, baby! Look who did it! <laughs> Woo! Did you fall? Let's go! I don't know if I got the best view for that, but honestly, I was just focusing on holding my glutes as hard as I could <laughs> so I could keep my balance. Look at that progress. Do you need some help? You sure you're good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Yeah, I just... <laughs> I'm curious. I wonder if I caught that on camera. <laughs> if I did, I'll make sure to tag you. Sorry about that. I guess I'll go ahead and close this vlog out. I hope you guys enjoyed watching um, our night skiing or night snowboarding vlog night one and hopefully I'll be getting a little better so that you'll be seeing some better runs from me um, and the rest of my team for over the next three days.